All right, for my first video, um, I'm going to be doing a bunch about the uh, Aussie Arc Bone Reapers as well as uh, other Warhammer stuff, 40k and Age of Sigmar, Sigmar and uh, any other miniature games I'm interested in. But I thought, I thought I'd start this off with a bang with this guy, who's really interested me, and then uh, I'll probably do some videos in the future talking about more of his uh, stats and strategies and uh, different ideas I have. All right, let's get into it. All right, so it's got one of those nice uh, full art slipcover boxes that are really nice. Just one sprue to hold all the different parts and guys on here. Quite a detailed base. As with a lot of these premium figures, they always end up being smaller than I think they are from all the artwork. too bad to build, but I don't think he's going to be very easy to uh, modify at all. Now one interesting thing I've noticed here is his war scroll is different than what's on the war scroll cards in the battle tome box, as well as the, uh, the Age of Sigmar app. And, uh, not sure how far, how familiar you are with it, but uh, all of the other versions, his wound track is uh, got some kind of a typo on it, and there's numbers doubled up. So I'm really curious if this is what it should have been: zero to two, three to four, five to seven, eight to nine, and then ten plus or if they uh, changed it on these, but uh, we're in a rush to do so and made a typo. But uh, yeah, we'll have to wait till they release a fact and uh, we're in a rata and uh, hopefully they clarify that better. All right, thanks, until next time.